yeah so I'm not using birth control my periods not here and I have weird symptoms that often leads to like one feeling like they're pregnant you guys so I just came upstairs to use the bathroom and I decided to make a quick video because the thought ran through my mind while I was up here about the whole pregnancy topic and I figured I might just sit down and talk to you up here quietly because it's not something I was um, announcing to everyone per se, but I was telling hubby today that I was feeling a little bit off. I haven't had a cycle since I've had the baby and so every month I kind of expect to see my cycle and when I don't see it, it throws me off. It just automatically makes me feel like I'm pregnant. Even though I feel like I'm not pregnant, but yet I sometimes have symptoms that make me feel like I am. It just all kind of psychs me out because I do expect my period to come and it doesn't. And I know that this happened, I think, in my first pregnancy where when I had my, after having babe, my first child, I didn't have my period for like 10 months. But then with my other ones when I was nursing, I did have it. So I kind of expected that I was going to just have a period after. And I did have like you know the postpartum bleeding initially after giving birth via c-section and um it lasted for about three to four weeks and then it subsided and then it kind of came back so i kind of assumed that a period was going to follow like traditionally but it hasn't my period just kind of stopped and it kind of or yeah the bleeding kind of stopped it went away and every month i'm just here waiting so anyways like I'm having these weird symptoms and they're kind of freaking me out. I think in my head I know I'm not pregnant and I I maybe it's just me. Like I know hubby and I we want we want to have more but gosh like at 5 months that would be so scary. I I feel to me and maybe not scary. If it's God's plan it's it's God's plan, but I don't feel ready to have another baby immediately at like 5 months. I think we would like to try maybe in the next not in the next year, but by the time she's like one. So that's like still months away. It's not any time yet. I feel like my body's still recovering. And I also want to lose the excess weight that I need to lose before I get to that point. However, it feels just kind of psyched out every month when my period's not here. So what I think I'm going to do, I think I might end up going to the dollar store and picking up a pregnancy test. I am not sure. Yeah, because I don't want to pick up an expensive pregnancy test. I know that there are differences between the blues. And to be honest, I actually want to do like a segment on that. Oh my gosh, I can hear baby girl screaming in the background. I want to do a segment on that. I've been thinking about it for a long time because I remember when I was pregnant, I wanted to do a topic on which pregnancy tests are good. And I know I tried a few that I definitely want to vouch for out there and possibly save people some money so I'll, I want to do a topic on that but in the meantime I am going to do a pregnancy test and I'm going to pick up a cheapie because I don't want to spend 17 bucks on a test and it's not pregnant because it's not it says no pregnant <laughs> does it say no pregnant it says not pregnant because um what who wants to do that like I said I I think I'm pretty certain that I'm not but I just want to make sure and you know comment down below and let me know if this ever happens to any of you guys um out there when you know after having a baby and your your period's not here when you're used to it showing up every month comment down below and let me know how you feel like doesn't it does it ever psych you out too and make you kind of feel like you're pregnant especially when i'm not gonna lie like we're you know i'm not on any kind of birth control so i think that makes it even like worse more nerve-wracking is that i'm not using birth control and um yeah so i'm not using birth control my period's not here and i have weird symptoms that often leads to like one feeling like they're pregnant but i can hear baby girls screaming so i'm gonna head out but that's just how i'm feeling and i'm sharing this candid moment with you guys and um shout out yeah leave a comment down below and let me know if you've ever felt the way i felt and i wanted like i kind of avoided wanting to i did kind of not wanted to make this video just because of all the pregnancy videos that are going out there so it kind of distracted me and i didn't really want to make this video for that reason but here i am i'm making it and yeah that's what is up so i think tomorrow i'm gonna go to either walmart or to dollarama i'm gonna probably just gonna go to dollarama and see what I can find there. In fact, when I go there, I'm just going to pick up a cheapie, a bunch of cheapies, because I feel like I'm going to be 
acting like I was TTCing all over again and I'm gonna be checking if I'm pregnant like every month just to make sure that I'm okay. I'm not drinking, I don't smoke, I don't do anything crazy as to why I need to like worry but it's just good to know, you know, until while my period's not, while my period's not here, I just don't wanna fret and worry. So hope you guys enjoy this little mini uh, rant. And it's not a rant, what is this? Um candid moment video i'm just sharing my heart sharing where i'm at and um i will be doing a bunch of these so let me know um what you guys think uh yeah i'll be sharing just more little snippets of how i'm feeling and i'm planning on getting a backdrop um a black backdrop so i can do my videos in a proper setting and i'm so sorry but like i said it's just a candid moment so thank you guys for watching and i hope you guys enjoy this little mini video much love guys bye